John, you do have lots of relatives in Texas oh, still. Oh, yeah. I'd like to just say uh, hi to Uncle Booty and Aunt Danny. Hi, Uncle Booty and Aunt Danny. <laughs> they just came out for Thanksgiving, so yeah, we have some uh, we have some wonderful, wonderful relatives and friends in Nederland and Beaumont and all around there. <laughs> John, in this movie, as well as Three's Company and everything almost that we see you do, you project such an up and positive attitude about everything. Now, is that your real image? I know it's your image, but is that really you or are you faking us out it's a little bit? It's all the orange juice I drink. It's so good for you. Blood sugar just hits. Um, I don't know about up because there's a lot of times where I'm down, but positive... I think I, I really am positive. I think I got that from my mom and dad. And uh, my mom, for example, uh, she wakes up like this, hi, and she goes to sleep, good night. You know, and from that, from the hi to the good night is just, uh, she's, a, she's a, like a sparkler. And me compared to her, I would be like uh, a punk rock guy from the Dead Boys or, or something like that <laughs> compared to my mother who's just, She's a skyrocket, and, and I guess I reflect some of her, you know, sort of positive energy, and I think I reflect some of my dad's, uh, you know, um, outlook on life, too. But I do have my moments where I'm a bit of a drag, I must say. <laughs> I wonder also, in TV Guide one time, you gave a quote, and you said, I'm terrified of everybody all the time. Oh, yeah. Are you really? Oh, yeah. See, I, I really have experienced that I am absolutely terrified of everything and everyone at all times. That, that you, for example, will hurt me, hurt my feelings, attack me. Uh, so for that fact, I learned karate, you know, uh, in the early 70s to, to ward off you if you start to scratch me or something. I know how to do that. I learned that out of fear. Uh, I learned how to be funny out of fear um, and all of that, like fear of somebody hurting me and stuff like that. But what the joke is, what the cosmic joke is, is that I know that everyone is terrified of me too. And everyone is, all of us, come on, let's all admit it. We're all scared. Yeah, they all admit it. We're all a little scared. You know, we're all going through life uh, over, over our left shoulder, as Carlos Castaneda says, you know, the, 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 the specter of death is always ready to go like this. So. We're all afraid to die, and I mean, in, in, in the bigger sense, we're, we're all a little, a little afraid when we get up in the morning if we're going to make it, but we mask that with our armor and, and our stuff like that. Well, I just come right out and say, hey, I got nothing to hide, man. I'm scared to die. I'm scared to live, you know, and, but all of that aside, it's, it can be a ball, and you can have love and have friends and have you know, have meaning to your life, but underneath it, there's a little guy going, I don't think I can make it. <laughs> <laughs> you and your wife are expecting a baby any time now, right? Yeah, yeah. Are I don't think I'll tell the kid I'm terrified until he's old enough to, uh, to understand that. Hi, son. Welcome to the world. I'm as scared as you are. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm really thrilled um, about Nancy should have the baby around February 10th, um, so. Just about the time the film opens. Yeah, yeah. Two little babies out there. Um, the uh, the idea of, of my wife having a little life inside really puts a perspective on 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 film and television and all of that is something that's fun to do. But this is where this is where the, the the attention should go on this new little creation that's coming out. You know, I feel like I want to be creative with my life. There's nothing more creative than um, than creating a uh, another life. John, are you at all concerned though that here is going to be your child? the child of a famous person, and if you don't mind, a superstar. Does that... Well, thank you. <laughs> does that concern you for the child? Yeah, it sure does. Um, and I, I keep thinking of like when my father, you know, like just different times, uh, the public at home, not no, but sometimes when you go out in public, uh, Nancy has sort of gotten an elbow, excuse me, <laughs> hi, John, you know, and somebody, uh, I don't want sort of people trampling over my child or him getting a lot of focus or privileges or attention or, or uh, annoyances from people because of his father. So I, or her father, who knows? <laughs> oh, yeah, watch it. <laughs> I gotta watch that. But I, I don't know. I'm gonna try to do it day at a time and, uh, and see if, uh, how many, 
I try not to make too many mistakes, but I hope the kid will forgive me. I know. think your positive attitude and your, your studies in psychology ought to carry you through pretty good. John. Hope so, hope so. John, I hope uh, you have a healthy, happy baby, and uh, I hope Hero at Large does a tremendous amount for your career. Thank you very much. Nice Brian. talking with nice you, Nice talking to you, Here too. Here in New Orleans.